Good morning, Wildcats. Today is Thursday, September 15th, National Felt Hat Day. I'm Grace Pearson, and welcome to WCTZ News. There will be a military officer and academy day on Saturday for high school juniors and seniors interested in learning more about leadership opportunities through military service. These include low-cost college degrees, officer commissions, and guaranteed jobs. The event will be from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. at the Brevard Veterans Memorial Center Gray Hall. Are you interested in building your character, developing leadership skills, and serving the community? Key and Beta Club is currently holding a membership drive for new members. Meetings are every Wednesday, Power Hour B, in Ms. Staten's room, 2102. To learn more, sign up for the Google Classroom using the code on the screen. Project Graduation is currently looking for golfers, sponsors, and gifts in kind for West Shore's 18th Annual Golf Tournament in support of the Class of 2023. For sponsoring gifts in kind forms, send an email to the email address on screen. Now to Cameron with a story about new teachers on campus. This year on campus, you may have noticed a few new faces due to teachers retiring at the end of last year. Six new teachers, including Austin Downey, Brooke Lenz, Sally Kempfer, Justin Snively, Corey Burton, and Sophia Wixted, have been settling into their new roles. Being one of the younger teachers at West Shore is actually a great place to be because you get to learn a lot from all the people that have been here for a while and it's been an absolutely wonderful place. Everybody's been so helpful in getting me adjusted. With high demand for teaching positions nationwide, West Shore's new teachers this year have a broad range of experience. Uh, I think the amount of new teachers is great, and most of them coming back are West Shore graduates, so they have a better connection to the students. It gives better opportunities for the students to be more engaged in their curriculums. The younger generation of teachers are bringing a new spark to the classroom. I have been wanting to teach at West Shore for many years. I, I've heard what wonderful programs West Shore has. I have heard wonderful students, the administrators. Um, I've heard such amazing things. It's really been a goal of mine since starting teaching almost. Will these new faces have an impact on your curriculum this year? For WCTZ News, it's been chemical. begins Hispanic Heritage Month. It runs from September the 15th through October the 15th. During the following month, we will be coming to you with information regarding Americans who have Hispanic heritage and fun facts from different Latin American countries, all of which affect your daily life in the United States. Thank you, Cameron. Representatives from the University of Florida, Florida Southern College, and Rollins College will be visiting campus next week. If you are interested in learning more about these colleges and their educational programs, see college specialist Angela Feldbush and the Media Center to receive a pass from class. A complete list of upcoming college visitations can be found by scanning the QR code on the screen. Powder Pup tickets will be on sale during Power Hour next week in the Pavilion from Monday through Thursday. Tickets are $5 each. Homecoming will be held on September 24th from 7 to 11 p.m. And this year's theme is Hollywood Glam. Ticket sales begin on September 19th and will cost $25. Wildcats, be sure to show your spirit during Spirit Week next week. The theme for Monday will be Barbecue Dad versus Soccer Mom, Celebrities for Tuesday, Senior Citizens on Wednesday, Class Colors on Thursday, and Wildcat Spirit on Friday. Thank you for tuning into today's edition of WCTZ News. This has been Grace Pearson. Have an amazing day, Wildcats.